What is up everybody? Sebastian's back for a brand new video. And before I dive into of what happened in my life recently, I would first like to apologize to all of you fans out there who was wondering where the hell is Sebastian? Did he quit YouTube? What happened? Alright. I'm going to explain a bit what happened recently, alright? So as you know, from April 20th till June 1st, I was an au pair in Mirano, Italy. And believe me, it was so hard leaving. If you ever become an au pair, alright, just know leaving is the hardest because you go from having your life in your own country start boom starting something new doing something that you love new culture new people new family new everything and then you come back home and it's like you 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 really like you feel heartbroken like right now like now that i'm back like i came june first home and like when I school do pictures and remember the beautiful memories I had in my host family and just this beautiful experience how they hosted me and stuff like just looking back it's like I I kind of like I got into the habit of working there as a new pair you know and boom coming back it's like it wasn't easy, alright? Believe me, it wasn't easy. Like, I... In my heart right now, like... To the part of me, like, that wants to go back. Alright? But I'll continue... Talking about that. Basically, if you want to see... How I was... One week before I left, here's a, cl a video clip. What is up everybody, Sebastian here. Sorry, I'm a bit emotional, but like, today is Saturday, it's Saturday today, <sighs> next week, June 1st, everything in my life will change, I came here, the 20th of April, I already need to leave June 1st next week. Leaving sucks. It sucks leaving as new pair. Like, if you ever become a new pair, like, <laughs> just leaving. I need to leave everyone behind. <laughs> my old child and my old parents and. Everyone behind. <laughs> it's odd. It's so hard. I, <laughs> I wish I could stay longer, but like, I have other stuff to do at home and it's like, emotional and <laughs> it's, it's hard, it's like, <laughs> I bet a lot of you experience being an au pair, like, <laughs> like, if you've been there for a year with the family or three months, six months, like, it's hard leaving. <laughs> it's the worst. It's, it's the worst thing ever. Like there's no way like leaving. It's like so hard. I mean, <laughs> so usually that Finn was looking for an old pair like longer. Um, and my host had even asked me, like, "Can you stay longer?" You know, like the first two weeks I arrived and I said no I can't um, and the reason why was because you know I had these exams to do like this medical one exam my driving exam and my physics course beginning of July so I kind of 
that's the reason why I couldn't stay. And it's like, now that I'm back here, it's like, it's kind of like, weird, you know? Like, there's a part of me like, that we are this, we only live once, once! And I feel as if, I'm not living up to my fullest potential. You know? Like, I wanna wake up every single day passionate in doing what I'm doing, you know? And while I was in the pair, like, I woke up so happy every single day doing something that I love, you know? And I was like, I have this goal I want to achieve to become an airline pilot. And I know I can do it. But lately, like, you know, with the studying and stuff, like... I've kind of been, like, slacking off on it. Because I'm thinking about... How much I miss my au pair family, you know? So it's kind of like, the mixed feelings I'm feeling now. Like... And like, a part of me, like, wants to become an au pair again, you know? But then another part of me is telling me, like, Sebastian, you're wasting your fucking time. Get to work and become an airline pilot. So, it's like, which one should I take, you know? And it's like, my, my dad, you know, he says, you know what? You should stop studying. But, in my heart, it's like, yeah, I know, but, like, au pair also loves to do, you know? So it's like, these two stuff, these two mixed feelings of, okay, what should I do, you know? And it's like, just a life tip for you guys, okay? There's gonna be a time in life where you graduate high school and maybe your parents and stuff, you know, since you're their child, they might want you to, you know what, go this path for, as your career. But you, you might be, want to, no, I want this. So you will kind of need to fight against the grain here. Kind of do what you want, all right? And believe me, it's not easy. Like, having a feeling that you disappointed your parents, or let them down, you understand? Like, for example, I remember, like, back, um, when, in January, like, uh, uh, my, my parents are doing so hard, yo, yo, get into flight school in September. And me, it wasn't authentic to me, I started, like, dropping ping pong, going less to practice, I started dropping ping pong, dropping some activities that I I used to do. And it's like, I wanted to become an au pair, so I went to our old staff for a month, you know? And like, even the family in our old okay? Back in January and December, I still have contact with them. And believe me, that was the best experience ever, and like, I do miss them also, you know? So it's like, like you kind of need to like, do what you want, you know. That's like a really good tip, you know. And believe me, it's not easy because like, when you think back, like, how much your parents done for you and stuff. And it's like, you do something else, you know, it's not easy, but it's like, now it's like, like, as a pair, like, you will have contact with your new host family for life, okay? It's like, they're your second family, you know? And it's like, um... Yeah, it's like, not easy, you know? Like, I, 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 I can't wait to wake up every single day going flying! Like, 
I don't care about anything except flying. Friends and au pair, like doing stuff that makes me happy, you know? Like, it's like... Yeah, it excites me. Like, I want to wake up every single day excited, you know? Which has been happening for the past month. And now I just can't wait for the next chapter in my life. Like, I, I hope to be in flight school by September. Or, uh, you know, go to America. Like, I'm more thinking of going to America this summer. Like, I see a bright future in me. Really bright. I, I want to live up to my fullest potential. And like, it's crazy thing, but one life, one life, one fucking life, okay? I can't waste time. I cannot waste time slacking off. Watching these bullshit YouTube videos. I cannot slack off, man. I I need to stop procrastinating. I like then there's a part of me like I'm procrastinating too much. <sighs> like I have resistance. Probably succeeding. <sighs> like yeah, it's weird. Like, there's a part of me like that's scared of failure. Like, I'm making a mistake. I have a lot of resistance to that. I want to do everything perfect. Then, like, there are friends that I still want to see. I haven't seen in a while. I think. All of these stuff, all of these mixed feelings, and like thinking about my future, like excites me and scares me at the same time. <laughs> you know? And then like I, oh, I need to oh, I need to stop working out again. Check this out. You see? I haven't been working out much, you know. And it's like, you know, while I was in Italy, there was the fucking gym, okay? There was the fucking gym there. And I was like, you know what, I'll just do it later, later. And I didn't even go to the gym, I just only went to the gym once. And all of the other days, I didn't go to the gym. I'm... And looking back, I'm such a stupid, fucked up idiot, man. I'm such an idiot. Why didn't I just go to the gym? Why didn't I go swimming more often? Why didn't I go and visit more cities more often? You know, like, as a new pair, like, when you're there, like... I don't I was a lot really stressed. And I felt different sensations in me. And now looking back, being now back in Belgium, looking back on my au pair experience, why didn't I not go more trips on the weekend? Why... Wasn't I... Why did I stress so much? Why wasn't I more chill? You know? And like... Just like... This appears like, like... You just become so much more independent. So much more mature. Uh, more organized. And... It's just like... A great experience. Like... If you... If you're wondering, should I become a pair or not, do it. Do it. Okay? I'll leave a link in the description of how to become an au pair. And I'm going to be doing more details on that coming soon, alright? So, I hope you enjoyed my video of, you know, of my life, like, sharing my thoughts and feelings to you of how I feel in life. Um, feel free to drop a like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends if you enjoyed. Also, comment below like what type of videos you want to see, etc., etc., etc. 
and I hope to see you soon. Peace.